welcome to this video about the Error Instruments Sticky Joystick Controller. With its joystick you can change parameters on other modules. You can press the joystick down to create a gate. There's also a built-in low-pass gate that you can use. I want to thank Error Instruments for sending me this module. I'll quickly just demonstrate what you can do with this module by patching the outputs to braids using the vowel algorithm. Let's quickly listen to how this sounds. So because these two parameters interact with each other, this is a really interesting thing to control with a joystick. So let's connect the CV X output, which is the output of the horizontal movement. Let's connect this to the input for the first knob. Let's first just listen to that. Now, an important thing to know about these CV outputs is that they send out a voltage between 0 volts and 5 volts. So when the joystick is in the center, it sends out a voltage of approximately 2.5 volts. Now let's connect the CV output for the Y axis to another parameter on braids. Let's tune this one down. Pressing down on this joystick generates a 5 volt gate coming from the switch output. Let's connect this to the FM input. Of course you can use this to trigger envelopes or drums or whatever you want. Here I'm just using it to change the pitch. Now to demonstrate what the low pass gate does, let's connect the output of braids to the low pass gate input. Let's connect the low pass gate output to the mixer. And then of course we need to trigger that low pass gate with some kind of trigger or gate pattern. Let's just use a pattern from Zularic Repetitor and you connect this to the trigger input. Now, as you might notice, the trigger is sending into the low pass gate input. It's also coming out of the switch output. So it's as if we were pressing down on the joystick. So this means that when we're using the built-in low pass gate, we can also just press down on the joystick to trigger 
the low pass gate. So let's remove the modulation from this trigger so we can just listen to the effect of the low pass gate. Of course we can still press this to keep the low pass gate open. Let's change the pattern. Let's briefly go to another algorithm on braids. So that's Sticky by Error Instruments and you can use this for everything you want, just keep in mind that this does not send out negative voltages. Thank you very much for watching, see you next time, bye!